Good evening. This is Mystical Machine Gun. I'm on camera now. Hello. You can see the messy shed behind me. No, no well curated game cupboard or anything like that. Unfortunately, I'm just relegated really to the shed. Tonight we're playing Fantasy Star Generation One on the PlayStation Two. The title screen is very loud. Spring 342AW, the city of Kamenit on the planet Palmer. Scum! Lashiek does not tolerate insurgents. Accept your fate. What? Why are the guards? Let me heal you, Nero. Is it Alisa or Elisa? Let's go Elisa. Elisa, listen to me. Lashiek has been corrupted. Palmer, all of Algol will be destroyed. While working alone, I learned of his plans. But he found me. I don't have much longer. Elisa, find a man named Tyrone. He's a rebel too. Why is heal not working? Love that. Stay with me, Nero. Please, don't die. Forgive me. Ali, sir. We need the body as proof. Ugh, it's dark. Nero. My brother. Lashiek will pay. I swear it. Intensity Isaiah for sure. Yeah. Please protect me, Nero. I will find this Tyrone. Maybe my neighbours can help me out. I need some supplies too. Nero, I won't be defeated. That's the spirit. You haven't died in vain, I promise. Alright. Okay. I must find time. Okay. So welcome to Fantasy Star. You may may realise quite pretty quickly that this is not the Master System version. This is the PlayStation 2 Sega Ages Volume 1 Fantasy Star Generation 1. Kindly translated. So, while the translation is different, the menus, everything all looks very similar. It's a, it's a lot more in line with how the later games treated the menu, as opposed to the Master System. You can see that Alisa has got heal. We have a little self-talk to see what we're doing and what we're going. I bet Nick can help. I'll ask him. There you go. Proving it's worth already. Do we have anything equipped? Got a short sword, and that's it. Okay. And no key items. So I thought I'd play this version because I've actually never beaten this game on Master System either. And why not play the slightly better looking one? I've got a PlayStation 2 emulator. I never played it back in the PlayStation 2 days because it only came out in Japan and in Japanese, so why not give it a go? So Fantasy Star, unlike its later sequels, has first person dun dungeon crawling. What have we got here? Oh, 2000 Masetta. Good start. Okay. So, in the later games, you would see all your party from a top down perspective, like Fantasy Star 2, Fantasy Star 3. But in this one, it is just first person all the way. And there is nothing at the end of this hallway. Okay. So I think this warehouse is just there just to give it a bit of a bit of a demo of what the dungeons will be like. I won't necessarily be mapping, although it may come in handy. Sharissa, I'm a merchant from Motavia here to peddle my goods. Customers say the guards killed a man. Such a violent city. So yes, so Nero is Elisa's brother. And he was doing some form of spying on Lashiek and got found out and killed. Nick! Hey, this is the guy we're looking for. I heard about Nero. Are you okay? I am trying. Did he ever mention a Tyrone? Tyrone? Yeah, he's in Scion. Scion. He never stays in one place for long. Head over there soon. Elisa, take this. 
got Laconian Pot. Okay. Dira gave this to me right before the guards. Anyway, you should have it. Thank you. Is that a key item? Sure is. Pot made of Laconia. Yeah, so there's... I know there's some... Thoughts about the anime stylings of these these redos, these jet these games, but if you would have asked me back in the early 2000s, do you want Fantasy Star with anime cutscenes and redone and not on the master system, I would have been there with bells on. This is Kamenit. Paralet is southwest of here. And I was a Mega Drive kid. I was a Mega Drive kid. So we never had a master system, but we did have the Mega Drive. And I remember renting Fantasy Star 2, which came with a bit of a guidebook. Loved it. Loved RPGs from the get-go. Who know? I heard that something is hidden in the old North Warehouse. Yes, 2,000 bucks, and we've already grabbed it. Thanks, buddy. Can we talk to people to get more dialogue? Some caves and di dungeons are pitch black. In those cases, you should buy a searchlight. Good advice. But honestly, I don't think you should explore caves alone. Will you help me then? <laughs> um, no. Ha! <laughs> oh, that's a good facial expression. I'm liking that already. Are you in a hurry? Yes? Goodbye. Oh, okay. My condolences, <laughs> Lisa. Nero may have been idealistic, but he was correct that our goal is in danger. Only you can accomplish his dream of peace. By my avenging Nero, I am no hero. Hey, there are happens if we go back. Remember to think before you act. Okay. I'm sure that had no greater impact. Look at the size of this place. Elisa. Suelo. Suelo? Some of these names. Can't pronounce them. I know that you're angry. I can't stop you. but I can heal your cuts and bruises and cure most poisons. We don't need any healing at the moment, so we'll come back later. Similar to Fantasy Star 2, you heal in towns and it costs money, so... Bacchus. A bit of Greek mythology happening here. You have my deepest sympathy for your loss, Elisa. Nero was a good man. If there's anything you need, just ask. Will you come with me into dungeons? When travelling, talk to people for advice and information. Hey Jim, we are oppressed here in Kamenit. The guards spy on our every move. Also, they kill us in the street. Try to be inconspicuous. I'll do my best. Although, guards killed my brother, and then I went, you know, running up to him and crying, so... Okay... First battle. So this is uh, how the battle screen looks for pretty much all the other Fantasy Star mainline games. We've got our characters in front. We, we see them from behind. We've got our enemies up the back there. We can fight, run away, or turn control over to the computer. Let's fight. We can attack, defend, use magic, do collaboration attacks. Oh, okay. We'll use an item. Well, there's not much else that Elisa has at the moment. Let's just attack. Always going to be happy that we can choose which enemy to attack. Nothing drives me crazier than when you can't target your enemies in an RPG. And of course the AI of the game decides that you need to, you know. We're more a secret police these days. Oh, good on you, God. Uh, when the game decides that you need to, to attack whoever. And of course, attacks the enemy with the most strength rather than one with one HP left. Tyrone? Never heard of him. Is he cute? <laughs> I think I'm a, I'm a fan of Elisa's facial expressions, at least. I've heard that there's a hidden village southeast of here. That might be worth checking out. Okay. Everybody here has only one line of dialogue. Oh, hello. Got some sort of store here. Thrift shop. Welcome, our inventory is fully stocked. Pellery mate, Roganine. 
Atlas Escape Cloth Searchlight. So let's have a look. Pillory Mate now. So that sounds like what Mono Mate would be. Roganine. Oh, okay. It restores 80 HP. Atlas brings up the mini map for 100 steps. So that must be for dungeons. Escape Cloth scares the enemy and lets you escape from battle. And the searchlight lights up dark dungeons. Let's have. We got some money. Let's have one of each. Although we shouldn't need to run away from battles too often. He doesn't have any battle equipment though, does he? Actually, let's buy. Let's buy another pillar and make some items. We've got no other way to heal at the moment aside from running back to town. So. Let's make use of that. Oh, hello. This is where we get all our gear. Look at all that stuff. I love the art style. I love the almost Robotech style of these games. Finally, a customer. Please have a look around. <laughs> Finally. Now, I'm guessing Alice can't use the axe, but the leather clothes will increase defense and dexterity. Yes, please. Equip now. That's handy. And again, we've got nothing to sell. We'll be open until the bitter end. That's the spirit. So we've got another healing point. The spaceship fly to Paseo, the capital of Motavia. Okay, cool. Got to talk to everyone. Got to go into every single house. Alicia. Oh, hi, Alicia. I'm Alyssa. We have almost the same name. This is Paralet, a police state. Be alert. Anything else? Only the armory and thrift, sh thrift shop remain if you want supplies. I, I can speak really well. Okay, going up here. Jar rule. We used to do a lot of interplanetary trade. Did we now, Jar rule? Jara is a dangerous cave south of Sion. Avoid it if you value your life. Okay. Phil. So we've got Jerul outside, we've got Phil in here. Pick a lane, game. Could be the translators. It would have been a fan translation after all. The demoness Medusa lives in the southern cave. Have I seen her? Of course not. Her gaze turns people to stone. How horrible. I haven't seen the statues myself, but why would anyone fight her? Very good question. Cannot pass. Good kids like you should behave. I think you will pass time to flip out and kill him, Elisa. The government really issues road passes anymore. I wonder why. The guards have yet to find Scion's Black Market. Okay, so we've got some clues of what to do next. But we've got some armour. We've got a hidden village to the southeast. We've got something to the south. Let's have a look. So, hey, feeling on him. Nice one. We have. Oh, hello. There's a cave. Battles may look pretty simple at the moment. But it's, you know, it's the early days of an RPG where you're fighting rats and bugs and seeing what you can do. Oh, hey, level two. Now, a very important question. Do we get free heals when we level up? No. Okay. Oh, that's not music. Yeah. Uh, let's use our searchlight. Hey, hey, there we go. Look at those graphics. Is it worth healing? No, because that's like 50 HP or something. Let's use our mini-map. Look at that. Oh, that music. It's great. Hello. 
we at? Oh, 3,000 Meseta. Jeez. Feels like we're rolling in the cash at the moment. Oh. Going to get right lined up with the next turn to take it. What have we got in this cave to fight? Devil Bat. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Okay, hang on. Uh, fight. I'm paralyzed. I may not be able to heal. We could be dying early. Game over. There you go. They don't muck about here, do they? Do we get the option to continue? <laughs> no, we don't. Oh, we could have saved, I guess. Off to a good start. Okay, let's uh, let's skip through this. Uh, can't hit start. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's speed run the first area. Okay, let's get through this cut three. Let's match B as much as we can. That's B, in it? Yeah. Talk some more. It's interesting how she doesn't mention Nick in this little monologue here. Where it's like, that would be a good time to mention Nick. Now, can't suspend. Oh my gosh, let's make it stereo. Message speed fast. Don't need, don't need vibration. It wasn't going to help anybody. Let's save before we do anything else. How about that? That was my mucking about save. I've just overwritten there. Let's. Now that we're serious. Okay. Alright. Let's go get that money first. But yeah, even though this is a remake, and it is the early 2000s, it is a remake of a game made in the late 80s when things were a lot more hardcore. Things were a lot more geared towards replay. A game wasn't good unless it was hard. Red enemy name means it's formidable. I wish we knew that before. That devil bat would have... Yeah. Oh well. But Scion is due east, so maybe we should head there first. FYI, don't attack the guards. Need any weapons. Oh my gosh, look at all this stuff. Why didn't I go here first? So I've already got a short sword, don't need that. Leather clothes and a leather shield. That might come in a lot handy, actually. Okay. Okay. We'll line up. We got this one up. We got that two thousand. Let's. I'm assuming we could have a sword in one hand and a shield in the other. What do these crystals do? So that's fire spell, wind spell, lightning spell, ice spell. Holds the power to restore. Okay. Obviously, I'm guessing these won't be one-use <laughs> items. Don't start any riots. Okay, sure. Oh, this guy's got a thrift shop too. Oh, there you go. So there's all the stuff we could have... He's actually got more stuff than the other shop. Okay. We've got anti-paralysis would have been handy. Maybe we should have used our escape cloth. Oh, the other guy's got Atlas, at least, so we'll, we'll buy one of those. Tran carpet, okay. Okay, that's looking a bit better already. Uh, we've pretty much... I don't think there's anything vital to talk to anybody about here. But we will be saving early, and we will be sa saving often, so... Let's go grab an Atlas... first. Before we 
go to Scion, which is due east. Yes, we can. Get some experience? Sure. So his name's Red too, so he's formidable, but I'm guessing it's because we're level 1. Oh no, miss. No good. I had poison. God, we're off to a great start. How does poison work? No flashing lights, no horrible noises. That's good. Happy with that. Some games when you get the poison effect, it go like. Arr, arr, arr. I know you're angry, and I know you want revenge, but I can heal you. But not for free. That'll be four dollars. Yeah, this is the gameplay loop a lot, like in this kind of game, it's go out, battle, this could be a bit dicey <laughs> at level 1, how much damage we get, oh that's not too bad, enemy designs, I love them, they're really good, like even on the master system, the, the enemy designs were big, oh now we're asleep, okay. We're getting, <laughs> we're getting all the status effects just to demo them for you. This plant has got a lot of HP, and we do not have a lot of HP. Oof. I hope we level up from that. Gosh, I'm going to seem like the biggest wuss to keep going back and, re and healing, but this is level 1 gameplay. Oh, jeez. That didn't look good for a second there, that was a bit dicey. I thought we were going to crash. Oh, you're going to give me this feel every time you heal me? Swello? Swello? Sulo? Sulo. I actually went, when I made that Twitter image for it, for this, it took me back down the past of some of the old Fantasy Star fan sites, and some of those have been around since the 90s. Like, oh, it's just pure nostalgia straight in the arm. So my plan is essentially on... Ah, oh, here we are in Scion. Johnny, this is Scion, a trade city. Thanks to King Lashiek, trade is lousy these days. Has the king snapped? I try not to think about it. It's a scary thought. Oop, come back. Tyron and his fairy friend have been gone a long time. Ever heard of Epi? You need a special compass to get there. I have not heard of Epi. Okay, that's a shop. Has he got anything different? Welcome to Palmer's best shop. Big, big call, mate. Big call. Uh, nothing we don't already have. Rarest of the rare can be found here. Good to know. Life is good. Happy days. Okay, Joe, you're probably the only person who's happy. Everybody else seems a bit upset. Lil Mo. Jara Peninsula is southeast of here. Scary place. The sacred Iron Claw is in Jara Cave. Oh, so there's claw weapons in this at least. Pop the fan on. It's a bit warm in here. Okay. Baya Malay is beyond the Turua Gate up north, which never opens. The robot cops <laughs> in prison dissenters in Triada Prison. Avoid them. The robot cops built in Detroit. -er. Okay. Sai. Tyron left Sion. Tyrone. He did. I like to stare at the sea and think about him. Okay. Hey, I, I did the sassy dialogue here, Elisa. Don't mention any idea of where he went there at all. Tyrone, is he a vendor, a traveller? Okay, you're not helpful. Oh, customers, I have many exotic imports in stock. Like a better sword. Look at that, so... Dexterity way down. 
can't use the gun, and we've already got the leather shield. Oh, we've got the money. Let's do it. Oh, look at that. Straight to selling, too. Very convenient. Come back soon. Okay. Oh, yeah. Safe point. That'll be handy. Let's do that. All the way up to level two. Why not? Uh, do we need to heal? Nah, we're fine. Tyrone? I think the animal Joe found said that name. If you see Joe, tell him to come home already. Okay, Joe was very happy being away from home. I'm guessing. Okay. Oh, don't run away, Wiz. Tyrone, he's out hunting Medusa. He took an odd feeling on The cat had medicine around its neck. It spoke, too. Oh, talking cat. You're not Joe, are you? To be on this house? Oh, yeah. She was no good. To us. There's Joe, 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 Joe. Faith needs me back home? No, forget that, let me tell you. Tell me what? My story. I found a talking cat in Medusa's cave. I sold it for lots of Masetta. Man, that cat should have cursed a lot. Oh my gosh. The merchant I sold it to lives in Paseo on Motavia, the whole other planet. Use a spaceport to fly to Motavia. Right. Well, that gives us a bit of a idea of where we need to go. At least, what are your thoughts? Should I stop by Parallel first? Well, we we can. So maybe the, the reason we got whooped by that devil bat is that we shouldn't have even been trying to battle them yet. Oof! Look at those numbers go up. That's role playing right there. This is Parallel. Don't risk your life, girl. Any idea how I can get a road pass? Oi, oi! Okay. So, Elisa said I should check out Parallel. The spaceships fly to Paseo, the capital of Otavia. Otavia's governor lives in Paseo. Okay. But have you got any information on how I can get there? I've heard that there's a hidden village southeast of here. Maybe that's the clue we need to follow next. Rather than the dungeon. How do I get a road pass? Okay, so they mention a road pass. No hints on how to get one. No save point in this little mini town either, it seems. So we can go try the cave again, or we can go to the hidden village. Maybe that's the way to be. It almost looks like we can walk straight to the the spaceport from where we are, but no, we just pass right through. Hidden village. Maybe we can try the hidden village first. Ooh, okay. My eye is red. I've got a long sword. Let's see how we go. Ah. Oof. I was about to say I like the numbers, but. A miss is zero, so that's no good to us. The thing with random encounters is the further away we get from our starting town, the harder they should get, so we'll see. Ah, oh, there we go. Oh, and we learned a fire spell. The 
names are a bit uh, a bit different from your Final Fantasy, but rather than a Faraga and everything else. But they still... Like the fire spells being flaily, at least that's kind of shows you... Hello. Ooh, look at this. I need a compass, but where can I find one? Somebody mentioned that. So we can't get to this hidden village without a compass. Right. I'm using the PCFX2 emulator. So there is a bit of uh, There's a, the occasional line you can see there. So if you have any hints, any thoughts on what I can do, let me know. Somebody in Scion mentioned how to get a compass, so... Playing this with a con controller. <laughs> There's a camera there, man. <laughs> Just feels right as compared to playing with a keyboard, so... But I am playing this somewhat blind. I, like I said, I'm, I haven't beaten Pairs of Tower on the R system. And I'm guessing this has different ways to go anyway. Yeah, so how do we get a compass? So what are our clues? We've got Scion's Black Market, which I've got no idea how to get to. Can't just walk off the screen either. planet. We don't have the compass. I actually normally don't save this often, but now I'm feeling very paranoid since we managed the game over super early. Maybe there's a clue in the cave. <laughs> they certainly don't mind the encounter rate being high. But we're already... those numbers... Ah, oh, I was going to try and get the 3,000 meseta just by walking forward. That will definitely come in handy. Now, should we use the Atlas? Why not? Why not? Pay a little in-game currency for modern convenience. Green slime. Every enemy is red in this game. Still going. Oh, let's heal. Look at that. Special effects. Oh god. He's lost all that healing too. Let's Out. This game isn't messing about. <laughs> what do we get? Pilt. Oh, okay. Can we equip that? Okay, no. What is it? Fairy vest for small animals. Okay, well that's not for us. Feels like this dungeon just wants to chuck the hardest enemy at Canada as the first submarine. Get past that, and things get a bit easier. Oh, there we go, level 4, that'll definitely help too. I'm not going to try and... min-max level ups. Oh, hello. 
Did Medusa petrify this man? I wonder if he can be restored. Good to see he, uh, he doesn't have a hair out of place after being frozen. Hello? Oh, wow. There you go. I did not know there were secret walls. This atlas is paying for itself. Let's go further in. Ah. Oh. She was trying to shake off the paralysis. We have anti-paralysis, but can we use it when we're paralysed? Well, Lisa's damage is appreciably going up, so that's good. Nothing worse than a game with weak level ups. Alright, let's try a bit of magic. Oh, we've got heal. Oh, bit of healing. What's Luxter? Uh, lets you escape from battle. Oh, there you go. Fire attack burns on enemy. 3 MP. And then our heal is that. Okay, great. Completely forgot in the first half hour that... Whoa, okay. <laughs> that may be overkill. But there you go. Way more damage than the sword. No chest at the end of this line. Let's go this way. The in-dungeon encounter rate isn't too bad. It's certainly not every step like Shining in the Darkness or something. I'd say to get further in this cave, we may need to restore our stony friend. Because I think we've pretty much been everywhere. Oh, look at that, level 5. Cranking through the levels. Okay, that's just a big loop. Okay. Okay. Okay, let's turn around. Get out of this cave. We need more clues. We need to talk to more NPCs. Need to do more role playing to get further. Actually, we should heal up first, shouldn't we? <laughs> Probably another bad idea. Oh, look at that. Free healing as well. We do have a limited inventory, and they do don't stack. So each pe pillory mate, you know, in instead of taking up one slot in your inventory and stacking up to ten or anything like that, it's just each pillory mate is a slot, is, is a item in your list. So, let's consult with ourselves. Uh, that's a useless clue. It doesn't help. <laughs> this guy doesn't sell atlases. Ah, oh, yeah. we want the other side. I wonder if I wonder if each searchlight, once you've used it in a cave, if you're then good to go, or if you have to use it every time you're going. Okay. So to the east is the beach. 
to the south is a village we can't access here. Let's try north. How dare you touch our level 5 selves. Okay. Alright, well that's not much to the immediate north, that's for sure. Oh, hello, Scorpion. The name is white though, so it's okay. If we can hit them, we might be right. It's a funny looking scorpion though. There are many, very many scorpions that can fly. Going forward, if I do feel I need a big grinding session, I may I may stream that, but I definitely won't put that on YouTube, so we won't bore the world with watching us watching grinding. This isn't even grinding, this is me trying to figure out where to go next. Because even though Elisa is saying to herself, Parallet, we've talked to everybody in Parallet, and they're not giving us much help. Level 6. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Alright. Come on. There's no, uh... There's no reduce random encounters item, as far as I know, in this entire series. So, no repel, anything like that. Can we just save out on the, uh, the map? No. So, this is that Jara cave, which they said don't go in there if you value your life. So, being level 6, we might be better off. Is there any reason to believe there would be a road pass in there? I don't know. Let's have a look. Is every dungeon going to have this gimmick? Oh. Right. Well, I hope those persist because that's a waste of time. So we've got two locked doors too. We're getting a big list of mysteries piling up. I better make start taking some notes. Okay. Pass Sion. Hello, we've got some walls. What is this? Tarua Gate. This is, those, this is that music. Enchanted. It's a very electronic looking enchanted gate. Obviously can't just walk around it. What else can we find? Crab! It's a pretty ordinary... Hmm. Right, let's burn the crab. Only 23. Oof, okay, but we'll take it. Decent chunk of change and experience there, so that might be a early warning that this is a high level area. But then we got a scorpion, so who knows. The random encounter table is messing with us. Level 7. I really want to scratch my ear. Oh, it's a Parappi! I know you. I know you from Fantasy Star Online. Okay, so we've got a compass we don't know how to find. We've got a road pass we don't know... Ah, oh, I'm missing a important part of RPGs, which is to go back and forth, back and forth. Nero. Home is not the same. Without you, it's cold. Empty. Is there a case for... Talking to everybody again. Scions, you east. I've been there. Okay, getting the dialogue from him. You want to know about Scions? I've been there. Yes, we found that. Loving the sass. 
Now, did we say no or yes last time? Let's say no. <laughs> Listen close, young adventurer. Palmer, our green planet, is temperate in climate. Motavia, the second planet, is arid. Colonization began in 183 AW. Lastly, Dezorus, the third planet, is covered in permafrost and was settled a century ago. These are Algol's worlds. Get a road pass to enter the spaceport and a passport to travel by spaceship. How do I get them? My condolences, Elisa. Nero may have been idealistic, but he was correct that Algol is in danger. Okay. So we need. So we don't just need a road pass, we need a. Compass. I'm just going to have to keep plugging away at the dialogue. And I, we haven't been into the healer in Parallel, so let's have a look in there too, just in case there could be an NPC in there. Could be like a Pokey Gym. Not Pokey Gym. Pokey Tonic? Gosh, I've got to stop preparing him for Pokemon. I've played lots of RPGs, it's not just <laughs> it's not just Pokemon. You wanna give me any clues to you guards? Something's hidden in the north warehouse. Let's quickly I'm not gonna burn an atlas on it, but could it be there's a secret wall as well? Okay, okay. <laughs> I get the hint. At least it's not damaging us by walking into these walls. Uh, uh, where is it? Maybe the 2000 said it was everything that was hidden in here. Maybe we don't get to come down here and get 2000 or whenever we want as well. So, maybe here? Nope. Right. It lets you move. Like, it lets you flow. Oh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's, gri it's grid based. Like, you saw the Atlas. But the movement is not grid based, so. I'm moving slightly between each grid. Nothing. Okay. He must have been talking about the money. Was hidden in here. Okay, worth a try. Elisa says we should go to Parallel. Let's go back to Parallel and talk to absolutely everybody we can. I, I prefer Fantasy Star 2's opening where you had missions. They told you where to go. Do not defy the king. Obey and comply. Okay, so. Check in with everybody one more time. Okay. Yes. Yes. Anything you know? Oh, can't walk on the grass. Don't step on the grass. Hello. Oh, you're. <laughs> We're open day and night if you need additional care. Also, we don't lecture you. Uh. Oh, let me guess. No, we didn't. We don't suddenly get the chance to buy a. If we suddenly like there was just magically a, a road pass in his inventory. That would be annoying. Let me out. Give me all your stuff. Okay, randomly kicking on things isn't getting us anywhere either. The armor. I'll have one of those, please. Oh, that big sword. Please have a look around. Oh, okay. Nope. <laughs> Till the bitter end. It's that cheery sales demeanor that we're after. Okay. Oh, out of the way, please. Yes, I know. And I need a compass. Where do I get a compass from? Get out of the way, Mary. God. Can't really wander around. So we've seen... What is that odour? Uh, nothing. Ok... 
Okay, can I give him something? No, okay. Is he bad at cooking or is he passing wind or I don't know. I'm not picking up on the joke there. Try again. Right. The guards have yet to find Scion's black market. I'm guessing Scion has a black market where we can pick up a road pass. But there is it. You know, obviously we reckon it must be in Scion. So what are we missing? Oh, hello. Hello. What am I missing? On the map. Okay, the map. The world. The world map makes this look like it loops around differently. Right? I'm honestly just mashing B. Yes, Joe. Where's the black market, Joe? Do I just walk out the back? What do I talk to him? Welcome to Palmer's best shop. The rarest of the rare can be found here, okay. Worth a try. That shop music reminds me of Final Fantasy VIII. Triple triad music. Spaces I can walk and not let me walk in them. Just block it off. I told Joe to come home. Do you know where the black market is? Do you know where the black market is? Oh my gosh. I, I bet that cat is the key to his survival. No kidding. God, I don't want to turn to guys this early. Okay. Good for you, Tina. That's a noble goal. Like, is it a case of... We can't walk off the map up here, right? I'm thinking of Fantasy Star 2 where... And walk around some of the towns to find hidden buildings. See that? See how what the dock looks like there? That's what it looks like when you're actually in there. If we walk in from a different direction... No, nah, okay, we get the same entry. Okay. This is why we've got the tag of casual playthrough. Let's go... Do some typing. Let's control F. Okay. right idea with talking to people but we didn't talk to them enough okay so that's good <laughs> I 
You want to buy a road pass here? That's illegal, lady. I've got sell contraband. Got it? <laughs> Stop and broad. Lovely language. Of course not. Who told you these lies? Lisa's getting angry. Fine, fine, but it'll cost you, finally. Buy secrets. Okay. You didn't buy here, okay? Check it out. Oh, I need you back to normal. I thought we had a. I thought we were buds. Okay. Now, with our road pass, we can go find out that we need to do something to get the passport. But that's right. God, I'm already hopping between planets. Thank you for cooperating. You may pass. Oh, look at that. Modern convenience. Proceed, citizen. Spaceships are ready. Is this your first trip? Look at these guys. They look like they're out of a uh, fighting game or something. Gothic's Labs design these ships. Gothic is nearby, sort of. Okay. Ah. Do we just buy passports? Is it that easy? 100% of that's nothing. Do you have a prior conviction on Palmer? No. Do you need any vaccinations? Uh, no? Application accepted, my other thing. Yes, got a passport. Okay, cool. Ah, oh, I should have seen what would happen if we said no. Uh, yes to any of those questions. If you lose your passport... Oh, there you go. Very handy. So if you drop it, we can give it back. I should say yes to vaccinations, by the way. Hello, did you forget to pack anything? So, we've got four Pellery mates. Don't need that much healing yet. One of each, that's all good. It's almost like a little, tour little tourist town, eh? Ah, oh, show me the spaceships! I want to see the whole spaceship! Let's save before we go into planetary. Okay. Paseo is Matavia's capital, an oasis city. The governor runs all of my... A governor runs the whole planet, okay. Be sure not to lose it. Okay, we walk out there. Oh, that's just the road back to Parallax, so I don't need to go there. I can't believe I was on the complete right track with who to talk, like just talking to everybody over and over again. I just had to try it one more time. Oh, the spaceships aren't happy. The ship to the Zorus is grounded indefinitely. The flight to Motavia is ready. Heading to Paseo on Motavia? Yes. Please board. Thanks. Oh, everybody's very polite. Oh, that's better. That's a cool spaceship. Wow, that was really easy. If anybody's played Fantasy Star 2, you'll understand why I'm saying that it's real easy. Why is it grounded, though? So now we're on the desert planet of Motavia. Our ships fly to and from Palma every day, every five minutes if you want. Flights to the Zorus are rare, and we will never tell you why. Okay. Oh. Can't get out, gotta go this way. Oh no, oh, more people to talk to first. Is there really a famous bakery on Palma? I heard that there's one in Norla Cave. Norla. The deadly antlion likes to hide and attack when you're least expecting it. Antlions bury themselves in the sand. When they hear your steps, they snatch you. And don't get me started on the worms. Worms? I do like how Elisa is reacting and talking to people. That's real cool. Passport, please. Yep, got one. I'm the one who let Nero pass. Why'd they kill him? Why did they kill him? Good question. Paseo. Oh my gosh. Memory. Tyrone. I'm sorry. Who? Never mind. A talking animal? Try the marketplace first. Oh, that's right. We're trying to get the cat back. This is Paseo, the capital city of Motavia. Back in the Dreamcast days, when I was, you know, 
launching out into the web for the first, you know, early days. There was an online chat room that I joined called Perseus Tavern. And we talked about Fantasy Star Online and stuff. Oh, takes me back. It's all text based. Baha men! Oh my gosh. Who named these characters? Vehicles can protect you against ant lions. Walk around ant hills so the ant lions don't bite. It's reasonable advice. Motavians and Dazorans speak indigenous languages. Good for them. You need translator rings to talk with them. Rings? God, Elisa seems horrified at the, uh, at the thought. Okay. You need permission to pass. You need to pass to get consent. And then I just walk past. Ooh, what's that? That remix. A lot of locked doors around here. Okay. Save point. Don't quite need that yet. A merchant. Try the market. Exotic goods are sold over there. A rare item can sell for a billion meseta. Holy moly. That's my thoughts exactly, Elisa. Tyro? Never heard of him. Sorry, miss. King Lashiek and our governor do not get along. Is that so? Is that so? Well, the guards seem friendlier on this planet. Want a talking cat for a billion meseta? Yes. Wait, is that a Laconian pot? Yes, why? I'll trade you the talking cat for it. Why not? I accept. Here's a little chatterbox. <laughs> You are so cute. It's nice to meet you. I'm Elisa. What's your name? Mm. I guess you can't talk after all. But your friend Tyrone really needs your help. Now's my name. Duh. My bud Tyrone gave me a vial of alsulin that can cure him. But I can't open it, Elisa. Poor thing. You believe me? Of course I do, Meow. Okay, he's in Medusa's cave. Let's go back to that planet we just came from. Let's hurry, Lisa. Come on. You got it, buddy. Rock and roll. Haven't even been to the weapon shop yet. Oh, there's more stuff. Just kidding. My goods are no trick, though. Haha. -ha. Okay, weird. Simple yet effective dagger, but it's less damage. Bastard sword, massive and intimidating. Simple mantle for espers and a frame, leather breastplate. Can't equip any of that stuff. I need to remember which button's which. I keep pressing A, but it comes to, you know, Japanese game, it wants the circle to be, you know, approved. Everybody's fully healed. Meow yeah, is level 7. Okay. Oh, got a better heal. Disarms traps on treasure chests and detects pitfalls and maze floors. <laughs> that would be great. So, have we been into every building? Yep, talk to that guy. We've actually got a party now. Us and a cat. Governor loves sugary treats. Me too, yum. I heard Palmer has a great bakery. It does? We should go, Elisa. You can travel by foot to Mahal Cave, head north. Mahal Cave is a sacred place that espers go to develop their magic and alchemy. A gift can get you into the palace. Ah, so we need a sugary treat to get into the palace, but we don't need to get into the palace yet, so. Vehicles can protect you against ant lions. Oh, that's right, Baha Men. <laughs> very, very late 90s, early 2000s music references in the names here. Ja Rule, Baha Men. You let the dogs out. <laughs> okay. Back at the spaceport, let's get back. Let's just planet hop, why not? 
our world has expanded quite quickly. And they're not charging us, which is good. Okay. So out of the spaceport first. And I need to save. So straight to the cave. On a quest for adventure. Now, hang on. Can we equip now? How do we give this? Ah, there we go. Because that we had that pelt that now may be able to equip. Sweet. Rare medicine that cures petrification. Okay, so we've got individual inventories as well, which is good to know. Let's see what Meow's like in battle. Oh my gosh, look at all those flies. So what does collaboration do? Can't pick collaboration yet, okay. Oh, gross. <laughs> I wouldn't want to bite a fly. But more enemies, more experience, and the Now, yep, we just gotta pay the searchlight tax. Now, our friend Tyrone was this way, I think. Oh gosh, let's take out the devil bat first. Seems like the way to go. Look at that, teamwork. Makes the dream work. There we go, well done. And then we turn right. Left, right, right, get there, uh oh, Let's see how Meow goes against Green Slime, okay, let's bust out some spells I think, let's do Green Slime too, so, Meow, have you got any offensive spells? Nope, just heal, that's okay. So much damage compared to physical attack. I actually don't know how many HP these bloody slimes have. Cure learned. Always love a new spell. So that's a remedy type spell. Uh, magic. Ah, have to wait till. Have to wait till we get to a battle to find out. Okay. This is where he was, wasn't it? Yep. Tyrone, I got help. Hurry, Elisa. So this is Tyrone. I hope the Alshulin works on him. Oh, gotta go into the menu. <laughs> I love how this is not a key item. I'm alive! You scare me, man. Sorry, Meow. I didn't think. I'm no match for Medusa or Lash yet. You look very blurry, Tyro. Who are you? I'm Elisa, Nero's sister. Nero? Yes, Nero was a part of the rebel force on Lashiek's tyranny, then the guards. They killed him. You met him? We tried to meet another good person dead from Lashiek's tyranny. Nero said to find you. He did? 
And you did, Elisa, so let's save up. Lashiek must be stopped. Tyrone, why did you fight Medusa alone? She has a mystical axe that can stop Lashiek. But I failed. I'm pathetic. Oh, Tyrone. Stop it. You'll get it next time. Fire up. But Lashiek is even stronger. Tyrone, don't give up. Hehe. <laughs> No worrying, little buddy. Quitting ain't in my nature. That's the Tyrone all the girls love. Here's my plan. We need to get the compass I hid in this cave. Hey, We're going to need it in order to reach Epi Village. Good idea, bird. Alisa, I'm indebted to you. I'd like to help you. I want to avenge Nero. What you need to understand is that it's only going to get tougher. Yeah, but we've got a party now. So look, I was adopted. But it didn't make Nero less of a brother than me. Nobody was saying anything like that. He protected me. Bloodline be damned. At least I'll protect you. Thank you, Meow. I'm sorry I yelled like that. Bloodline be damned. You've been through a lot. It's alright. Thank you. We're a team. Let's avenge Nero. Where's the compass? <laughs> Is it behind this door? Everybody is holding out on me with information. <laughs> so I'm guessing we need to go down a dead end. And suddenly, now that we've got Tyrone... Actually, I didn't even look at his stats, did I? Okay, yeah, so... This is level 8. Ah! Meow, level 7, Tyrone level 8. He's got the Iron Axe. So why is it in the store? I'm never going to buy it. Anyway, let's do some healing. Alright, there we go. So, let's try all the dead ends and see what we can find. Oh my gosh. Can we collaborate yet? Nope. <laughs> See what Tyrone can do. Oh, the beefy looking axe. One of my favourite characters in Fantasy Star 4 was Grizz. And he wields a big, big, big bad axe. That was part of the appeal. Made an awesome clunking sound when he hit when he hit enemies with it. <laughs> Look at that! That's some damage output. Tyrone, welcome to the team. I didn't really need to use the Atlas again, but I will. Just wanted to check for any sudden new secret passages. Alright. No idea where this compass is. Let's just attack the most dangerous one first. How about that? And then mash B to win. Level 9. Level 9. Okay. Oh. Removes negative status for one hour. There we go. Maybe Tyrone can make a bit of a more of a dent. 24? Not bad. I'm not going to say no to one hitting one of these enemies, though. But at least there's a... Oh, look at this. Telele land. That might teleport us between towns based on other spells. Can't do it from here. Holy 
encounter it. Gotta love an efficient battle though. It does say B1F, but I haven't found the stairs down or up. Just, you know, the exit. That's it. Okay. All three attack a slime at once. Nope. Nothing I hate more than enemies that heal themselves. Uh, if there's no interrupt, if there's no way to stop them from doing that attack, it just prolongs the battle with, without adding to the complexity of it. It just makes the fight longer. So, definitely not my type of enemy. In a Persona game, for example, where you could do something to stun the enemy, you know, to stop them using it, then yeah. Hello, this wasn't here before. Compass found. Oh, I could have cast that rap spell then. There you go. Okay, now we've got the compass. Is that a key item? Allows you to locate anything. Okay, great. Tyrone cannot cast spells whatsoever. So. We can't cast the spell to get out of here. There is. In the uh, Mega Drive games, they were called Escapipes. As an escape. Of course. And there was a spell that went along with it. Pinus? Roika? And those spells essentially link to escapipes and telepipes. Telepipes will take you between towns you've been to, escapipe gets you out of a dungeon. So, what I'm getting at is that there is no escape spell yet. So we have to walk, do it the old fashioned way. Double figures, look out. That says progress to me. Should we say before we try and go to this visit village or should we just walk straight there? Oh sad. Should we get our bearings before we do it? Great items on sale. Yeah, buy another one. Need more searchlights, actually, if there are any more dungeons. I think we're doing alright for everything else. Oh, Tyron doesn't have any armor. I'll have to get him some armor. Hot new weapons. Take a look. Our products make any battle easier. Titanium sword. Heat gun. Frame. Barrier. Bronze shield. Ooh. That's a good bit of extra attack. Automatic gun with superior attack. Ah. Tyrone can equip guns. Tyrone can equip breastplates. So we'll, let's get him some armor. That's a good place to start. Let's remember what the buttons are. Must say, futuristic shield meant for espers. Okay, I don't think we've got any sort of SP yet. At least it's got a shield. Let's. Can we afford this and the sword? I'm going to stick with the axe for Tyrone, but let's get the titanium sword. Let's equip it. Let's sell the old one. Oh, this is so convenient. Can't get over it. We bought that, didn't we? Yes, okay. We'll come back when we've got more money. But let's heal while we're here. Welcome, how may I help you today? 
So they, they do convenient things, and they do things like make you have to press heal three times. Okay, let's talk to the people of Epi. Hi, Tyrone and Meow, what's up? Lots! You guys need to talk to Mayor Hashim. Is he the mayor of the planet? Oh no, wait, that's governor. The mayor is at home. Okay. Good for the mayor. Welcome to Epi, the hidden village of Parma. Did the compass guide you here? You should speak to our mayor. Usher. <laughs> There's another music reference for you. Laconia is the strongest material in all of Algol. It's very rare though. Your pot. It's okay now. This is a pot though. Must have been worth a billion Masetta. Tatiana. Motavia has a place of study just for espers. Neat, eh? I hope I can become an esper someday and learn magic. Randy, have you thought about going to the governor of Motavia for help? Yes, but we need to give him a present or something. We'll all do our part to restore peace in Algol. Are we at war? Let's go talk to the, the mayor. It looks very much like arm. Um, he's also got big axes and blood-stained fireplaces. Ashim. Well, well, it's Tyrone. Did you get the axe? Almost. Medusa turned me to stone and fled. My friend, save me. You bum rushed her. <laughs> ha, that's just like you. Anyway, now, who are you, miss? I'm Elisa Landale of Kamenik. That name. Lashiet killed her brother. We're going to avenge his death. You should speak to the governor. In Paseo? You can't get past the gate, Hashim. How do you know that, Tyrone? You are still stone. I used to advise him before Lashiek changed. I hid my key in the north warehouse of Kamenik. So there is something hidden in the warehouse. Thanks, old man. Let's go now. I've got to return the compass first. No, keep it so you can visit me. If it falls into Lashiek's hands, if I fail, Epi could be found. I trust you. Go on, keep it. You'll be fine. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Enough chit-chat. Lashiek tightens his grip on our goal with each passing moment. Now go. We'll defeat Lashiek, Hashim. Go. Cool. Let's recap. <laughs> Hashim's key is in Kamenik's warehouse. Yep. We also need to talk to a Mary in Parallel about getting some taste cake. That was good. Nobody mentioned that, so again, worth it to consult regularly. What have we got? We got flags. One hit for each of us. We should also go to Sion and see if people have different things to say. <laughs> We've got Tyrone and Meow. Always worth revisiting for to see if there's new dialogue. Part of the fun. Part of the fun of the game. Oh. Controls. Noala Cave is due north. There's a cave. There's a cake inside. There's a bakery inside. Blech. Hey Joe. Ah. I mean, hi. <laughs> Lisa, this is the motherfucker that sold me. Let me at him. You like my fangs, pretty boy. Beep. Meow, people do stupid things sometimes. Forgive him for me. Okay. Oh. <laughs> hey, asshole. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I'm so sorry. Oops. Didn't want to go in here. I want to go talk to that girl who looks at the ocean and dreams of Tyrone. <gasps> Tyrone, hi, hi. Tyrone, she looks like she's kind of faint. Why? Because she loves you, dude. So Tyrone, did you trounce Medusa or did she beat you? <laughs> we'll be in later, Wiz. Short story, got beat. Hey, you are that talking cat. I ain't a kitty cat. Okay. 
So, warehouse first. Talk to Nick, see if he has any thoughts about the fact that we gave away his pot. Oh, you got a pet. I'm <laughs> not a dumb pet, what gives? Everybody's getting stuck into the poor cat. Okay. Let's try again. I must admit, I'm not a big fan of the magically things are there where they never were b before. I mean, I know these games need to be linear to a certain extent, but it would be the end of the world if we found a key. Found a chest. Open it. Hashim's key found. Would it be the end of the world if we found a key before we should have? Like... Yeah. Unlocks the governor's palace, but we need a present too. It is a sugary treat. Let's go talk to Mary. Let's walk in a straight line. Okay. May we never have to go to the warehouse again. Let's take the overland. Probably not faster than walking across the overland map, but no encounters. Where was Mary's house? You pet, what's his name? Oh god. You are <laughs> nuts. I've got to get one. Prob meow. So you're Tyrone, huh? Sorry, you're not my type. Too bulky. What? Ignore her, Tyrone. After waiting to find out if he was cute. Ah! I've heard there's a hidden... Yes, Mary. Isn't that who we had to speak to about the bakery? Did you stone you? Oh, I get it. What? Tyrone the stoned. Haha. <laughs> you almost got me, guys. Stoned. Hee <laughs> hee. Alisa, he's stoned. Yeah. Let's just go, okay? Razor sharp wit and dialogue. Use it soon. The spaceport is going to be closing. Bad times are upon us. Hmm. Interesting. Is he right? Is he just being foreboding for the sake of it? Either way, there's a cave we need to get to. There's a cave we need to get to. Save our game on the way. Oh, oof. Nothing worse. Steps outside of a town on a random encounter. Boop, 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 boop. Gonna face the right direction. There we go. They mentioned the caves to the north, so we've got this gate here, which I don't think we can get through yet. Yep. Come on, Lisa, I want some cake. Let's find Mary. We did, we talked to Mary. We talked to her. Hmm. Do we have to talk to her like ten times or something ridiculous? We haven't been as far north as we can go, I don't think. I think we can work ar around that gate. Let's just talk to Mary. Yes. That's right. Yes. 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 Uh, you're not helping. No, it doesn't seem to be a translation error, it's just she doesn't want to talk to us. But we said about the cave anyway, so let's go north.
The advantage of playing a game like Fantasy Star of Metal Gear. Drink in one hand, smashing B with the other. Still a weird looking crab. Look at that armor though. Our hits definitely went down. Aha! Uh -huh. Ooh, couple of enemies. No, I'm not gonna sing. 69. Nice. Nice damage. Okay. Aha! Uh -huh. Do I not have a spotlight? <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. That's embarrassing. That's real embarrassing. <laughs> I have to go get a spotlight. <laughs> of course there's a shop in Australia called Spotlight that sells like Manchester and stuff, so... Always have a weird relationship with the game spotlight. I'm gonna go get some sheets. Look at that sky texture with the clouds flying. Oh, it's great. Great. Okay. Uh, we want an item shop. Please sell spotlights. Searchlights. There you go. I'm even calling them the wrong thing. Unfortunately, our money, our money stocks haven't really gone up that high. Of course, now that I'm on camera for the first time, I need to sneeze all the bloomin' time. My nose is itching me. That. Yeah, I've got a pretty beefy hit, so let's just do magic heal. There we go. At least he's got plenty of MP at the moment as far as I can tell, so based on what we've been doing so far. Oh my gosh, just let me walk in the cave. Let me in! See how. Oh, it needs a key. What kind of key? Let me guess. Mary knows something about this key. This game is very obtuse so far. <laughs> Like, all of this isn't brain-bending or puzzles or anything, it's just... Go here, you need something else, talk to more people, go here. Ugh. You get the idea. notifications which I never get, so I thought I'd better clear them out in case they're coming up on the audio. Uh, let's talk to Mary again. Hey Mary, know anything about this key? Oh my god, Mary. Okay, quick check.
walkthrough says that we just need to talk to Mary, that she should just give us a key. So, that's bad. Like, it's essentially saying once we've got Hashim, Hashim? Hashim's key. Mary should just pick us up. Pause for the night. If we can't get the key off Mary. Maybe via going because we went you know, via We've got a Sheen's key. Let's go consult, you know. Let's find Mary, yep. Look down here. Talk to Mary. She's given us nothing. All right, I will go away and re and uh, have a look and see what we need to fix this. Worst case scenario, we I start again off camera. So that'll do for the evening. We've got a mystery to solve, a key to unlock, a door, and cake awaits. This has been Mystical Machine Gun. Have a good evening.